Hello. We are waiting for this to wipe the same. How are you today? Is it cold or warm? We have a beautiful winter. Hello. Say hello to Sammy, where are you? <laughs> Sammy probably is making the new haircut or something. <laughs> Getting ready. Hello. Hi. Hey. <laughs> so good to see you. Oh, me too. I was wondering if I'm doing everything right. <laughs> oh, okay. I've never done this before either. So. Me too. So I love the lights you have. <laughs> yes. It's really been cool. all year for me. <laughs> Where is so let me, let me guess who is that. So that is Dina. No, it's a copy of Sam. That's it's Lily. Oh, I, I always confuse them. Wait, let me, let me get him. He is sleepy now. He was sleeping. Yes. Hello, Sammy. Finally, I see you. <laughs> he needs a haircut. You don't. You can see his eyes. Okay. I see his eyes. I see. <laughs> look how they look alike. Yeah. Very do good. you do you cut Lily's hair yourself? I mean, both. No. 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 Okay. I have because a good it's... friend that she is requesting to bring when when she sees the photos and said, "Oh, you must come." <laughs> That's nice. Thank yeah. You. I tried to cut his hair once and it didn't go well. So. Okay. Uh, I yeah. did very bad, but then uh, so, uh, I quit grooming uh, career too. <laughs> <laughs> Sammy, how, how are you today? Hey. You don't hi. Have to, uh, how it is called? This what? big uh, blue around the head. Oh, the donut. The no, donut. because now he's okay with the allergies. Okay. Now he's not scratching anymore. I don't know. It's a, oops. It's a really good period for him. It, it, because, then, uh, because you find out uh, uh, the reason? Uh, for the allergies? Yes. Yeah, it's the dust mites. Okay. Yeah, we, test, we did the blood test and... He basically he's allergic to dirt, to dust. Okay, <laughs> that's, yeah. that's really awful. Yeah, that sucks because even in I learned that even in, at home, no matter how clean it is, there are always dust mites. So you, there's no way to get rid of them completely. You can just reduce their number. Okay. Yeah. So oh, he's falling asleep. Yeah, me. How old is Sammy? Sorry, what? How old is Sam today? Oh, it's two and a half almost. Oh, boy. Yeah. Just a puppy. <laughs> yeah. Well, how, how old is Lily? Isn't Lily kind is of the same? three and a half. Oh, she's younger. Yeah. 
Look how he look. This is incredible. He actually falls asleep like that, like with his head like that. Now I see that all your photos are are not photoshopped. <laughs> <laughs> well, they have some effects, but yeah, he's cute. Now he's clean, so that's why. Sometimes I I apply some effects to make him whiter. Okay, <laughs> oh, that's normal. <laughs> Yeah. Can, can you tell me more about uh, Sammy, uh, what kind of vest he is? Because everyone is very different. Yeah, he is, you know, when I, before I got him, I was reading about Westies and how their personality and, and he is exactly yeah. like that, you know? Yes. Stubborn but, but and... Think... What? He's too good for a vest to <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, but he he can right now he's really being really nice and uh, sleepy, but in two hours from now he becomes a different dog. He starts going outside. He wants to bark at the dog. Uh, he he's like that. Very he needs to be at the center of everything. Yes, of course. He's a white dog. That's why. Yeah, and he's not a lap dog, you know. He doesn't usually stay like this in my arms. Okay. Yeah, no. That. But now it's because he's so sleepy. But I'll, I'll I'll put him to sleep. But usually, no. He's very independent. He wants to be by himself. Look where he sleeps. Okay, that's more about West. More like West. Same. Yeah. You have a very comfy bed, I see. Yeah, yeah. I got this actually because he likes staying in very um, fluffy things, mm -hmm. but they they gather dust. So then I I found this which has it's has like, this yeah, yeah. So it doesn't. It's not textile. Okay. So so that's safe for him. So that's his bed. I, I think he understands that's why he likes <laughs> this bed. Yeah. Thank you. Very nice. Uh, is he stubborn like all our Westies? Very stubborn, yeah. Sometimes he, I walk with him and he stops in the middle of the street. I put stories. I don't know if you saw the stories yes. about this. Yes. So he just stops in the middle of the street and starts, just doesn't want to go. <laughs> he just wants to go in the opposite direction what he always does. And when you yeah. start to walk in the direction, he already changes his mind and goes to opposite. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> and he wants to do a zigzag and stuff like that. And uh, sometimes he's driving me crazy. I admit that. <laughs> okay, <that's> but, <laughs> yeah, but you know, he, it's part of his charm. Yes, uh, he's very, very cute, especially in photos. Uh, was it very hard to teach him to pose? Because you are doing very good. Uh, actually, <laughs> mm, I, he doesn't really pose. Sometimes I, I have a treat and I hold him like this, oh. hold it. Or sometimes I, I fool him. Sometimes he's so distracted, he doesn't want to look at me. So I say the word for cat. Okay. So then he looks <laughs> right at me. And that's the perfect photo. Okay. And it works every time. He always, he always does that. <laughs> and, and he still believes that the cat is somewhere around. About the cat, when you say, look for a what? cat. And he, uh, he still I just say, yeah, just the word cat. And he, he starts looking, yeah. He looks at me first to make sure that he's like, dude, seriously, it's a cat. And then he starts looking around. Yeah. So maybe it's like um, uh, he thinks it's a trick he must do. Uh, for example, <laughs> a cat. I don't think so. <laughs> <laughs> no, even when uh, when he sees when he sees a cat, you know, I say leave the cat alone, and then he he goes after it even more. Okay, yeah, it's crazy. Are 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 the girls the same with cats? Uh, not the cat. We. Mostly use uh, human names, humans uh, they know. For example, uh, some of my friends or sisters, they love. So if I tell these names, they, where, where? <laughs> <laughs> That's so cute. <laughs> it's 
seems like they really know these people and well, yeah. <laughs> yeah. It, it's very nice that um, uh, you are using, um, how to say, you, you have a lot of uh, followers and you use uh, that account uh, of Sammy for a very nice purpose to, to show people how to treat uh, with some problems or how to, to live with a dog. It's very nice. Yeah, you know, I, I don't, because I, I've been through some stuff with him, so I don't want to say, look, how it's done or anything like that. But I, I feel like it's, it's been so difficult with this journey of learning how to take care of him and with his allergies and everything, training. So I think it's useful for, to, to share that with people. And also because I, I get a lot of questions on Instagram about uh, various things, you know, how well, like, why do you feed him? How do you get him to be so obedient and stuff <laughs> like that? So yeah, I plan on writing more uh, on the blog, writing more articles about it. So you will have a blog, Instagram account and a calendar, yes? And yeah, and Facebook page and uh, a YouTube channel where this year I will post more videos. Okay. <laughs> yeah, because I post on Instagram a lot of videos on IGTV and reels and stuff like that. So I want to put them on YouTube as well. That's a very good idea because uh, on YouTube it would be easier to find. Yeah. And there are not a lot of uh, videos of Westies. Oh, yeah, but it's never too much. <laughs> yeah, you no. Learn. Yeah, they're, but they're not too many. No. Uh, when before Sami, I was looking at every video I could find, and on YouTube there were a few accounts, but not. I didn't l learn so much. It was I more on Instagram. There are more fun stuff uh, on YouTube about Westies, not um, yeah. to, uh, and not so much information like about exactly. Them. Yeah. Yeah. So when you maybe wrote, I'll I'll do more. And when you wrote about this strange allergy wow <laughs> let's talk about this <laughs> yeah. how did you i don't know how to did you find out you must do this test um yeah so before the thing was like this i'll tell you from the beginning he was uh, he started licking his paws and i didn't i had no idea i heard that most westies get allergies but i didn't know anything about it and he was about a year old and he was just leaking and chewing away at his paws. And I put a story on Instagram and I showed him, oh, look how funny he's chewing his paws. And people started texting me and saying, this is not okay. This must be an allergy. Oh, so, that's... yeah. So then I took him to the vet and I asked and she said, it's an allergy, but we don't know exactly. You can, there, she said initially, there's no way to know. It could be anything. It could and be how, the grass or the food. How and often are you licking the house? Sometimes every night. And, okay. and then it started getting worse and he was doing it all the time. All the time, okay. Yeah, during the day, you know, he was sitting and licking and chewing and scratching. He started scratching his neck mm -hmm. and chewing his tail. Yeah, so... And uh, I don't know what, it was about half a year before we did the test. So we okay. kept doing, we kept trying. She gave me a product to put on his uh, paws that is like a disinfectant. Mm -hmm. And she said it will disinfect his paws. I should wash his paws after walks and then put that thing. And I did that. It didn't get any better. And at some point I decided let's do the test to see because if it's food, because many people said it's food. And then I could give him a sort of food that is hydrolyzed protein or something like that, you know, mm -hmm. that is for that. So we did the blood test and uh, yeah, it's dust mites. <laughs> and it's like a high allergy, you know, the, the um, it's 300. If it's over 300, it's an allergy. And he had 3000 and something. Oh, so. right. Yeah, so it's a lot. And also she said it's dust mites and storage mites, which are um, these, I didn't know, but when you store like flour or cereals or stuff like that, rice, 
they there come these mites there. He's okay. allergic to those as well. Yeah. And so it was better after we tested, it was easier because we knew what to do about it. I mean, I knew that it wasn't food. And then the vet said, you need to give him bath every week so that this way you take off the allergens of his uh, coat. So yeah, I started doing that and uh, it's, now it's better, but there was a time around before Christmas when no matter what I did, it was bad. His paws were getting really red mm -hmm. and raw, you know? Mm -hmm. And the fact he was leaking was doing worse because uh, the humidity, I don't know, brings the, the bacteria, yeah. you know? So, yeah. So now it's really good. It's been like two months, I think, or a month or something since he's okay. So that's why he's wearing sometimes this stupid <laughs> yeah it's uh, because it's uh, it's soft because you know there are those dog collars as well that we we used to put that on him but he was so uncomfortable during the night so then we switched to the donut and he yeah, if if it's bad he has to wear that every okay. day and every night and what uh, if to wear some kind of socks or shoes? I don't yeah, I tried. So I tried with socks um, and I was um, putting on the creams at night and then the socks so he couldn't lick the cream. And then the vet said that it's not okay to, to put socks because uh, breathing. Yes. Yeah, it, the skin is not breathing and then it's worse. So I, yeah, I didn't anymore. Maybe we should try linen socks. <laughs> yeah, that that way the skin breathes. Yeah, I, that's an um, idea. Something because this donut, I think, for Sammy is not the uh, happiest moment. No, <laughs> all his uh, photos with that are like that, and he has a face like, you know, mm -hmm. like oh. <laughs> <laughs> so it means yeah. uh, he feels better outside. Not at home, there are more allergens. Uh, they're outside too, so oh. it, they are everywhere. But it, they, she said that during the winter, it's, they are worse. They are more inside. Of course. Yeah, because uh, you don't, uh, they, you don't have the windows open so much, and you have a lot of um, fluffy things like the blankets mm -hmm. and stuff. And she, yeah, it's apparently there are more. Okay. Yeah. So now, now I know how to deal, at least uh, to help Sammy. Uh, yeah. Yeah. But yeah. it's, it's uh, for for good. I mean, it's for whole life. You will have to hear. Yeah. And they're they they never go away. You can't heal an allergy, and it could be worse in time. But it could also be better. Some people say that maybe he gets used to the allergens and he develops a sort of a, an mm. immunity. Okay. So, but also other people, I, I heard a lot of stories of it getting worse with age. And uh, so, do you find many Westies uh, with the same allergy? I think, uh, I think I had a few on Instagram with the dust allergy, but most of them have other types of allergies like food or grass. There are a lot with grass allergies. So I don't know. Yeah. I mean, the, but not, the, knows. not everybody knows maybe. That it's yeah. Possible. Many people know they have some allergies, but they, they haven't tested for it. Mm -hmm. So they don't know what it is. That's why it's very nice that you wrote a big article. <laughs> Yeah. Very generous of you. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. But no, seriously, I think, uh, I hope it's going to help people as much as uh, possible. I don't know. Yeah. Because there's not a lot of information uh, about the Westies allergies. You know, yeah. like if you, if you look online, <clears throat> you don't find a lot of, you, you find that they are very prone to allergies and that it's genetic, I guess. Mm -hmm. And uh, most people just give uh, medication and they 
it eases the symptoms, but it doesn't heal the allergy. Yeah. So I'm trying to postpone that as much as possible. It's, it's very good. That's why I, I decided I need to call you immediately. <laughs> <laughs> we must uh, spread this news. <laughs> spread the word. Yeah. yeah. But truth is, it's a lot of work. So, because I understand why people choose to give medicine, you know, because um, if you don't have the time, if you're not at home a lot, I work from home, so it's easier to to put, like every after every walk, wash his paws, put some spray on them. I can do that, but I understand most people don't have that time. Yes, yes. So, yeah. Not everyone is so lucky like you and Sammy. <laughs> yeah, it's true. <laughs> That it, it was very nice to, to talk about Sammy with you. Yeah, it, let me see. Um, we have some viewers here. Yes, yeah, somebody but... was waving to, to us. Yes. Uh, yeah. I think I will save this video and uh, we can post it to YouTube. Sure. You know, to spread a little bit more. Yeah. Do we have any comments or questions or stuff like that? I don't see anything. I don't know how it works. I, I'm not sure. Maybe next time I will know more. <laughs> <laughs> I think people are viewing, waving. What questions? Do you see people? waving? I don't see anything. No, I, I no. see some stars. <laughs> I think we will see later. <laughs> Yeah, I thought that people are, uh, were going to ask some questions. Well, they are very happy to see Westis, I think. It's more of a... Yeah. <laughs> Let me see Sami here. Ladies and Westis, what else? <laughs> <laughs> Look how Sammy. he's sleeping. Thank Sammy. you for your time with us. Thank you that you gave us your napping time. <laughs> <laughs> hey, what's the weather in Portugal now? What's the weather? Oh, it's good yeah. now. Good? Um, it's warm, look, I have yeah? a picture of your girls here. <laughs> How nice to meet you. Yeah, they are so cute. Um, it's really good now. It's, uh, it's been raining for like two weeks, which was great because we got to wear the raincoats from you. I, I'm very sorry. You said it's not raining at this point. <laughs> <laughs> but rain. Now it's great weather. Now it's like uh, spring, okay. but it's rained for a long time. It's which usually it's not usual. Uh, this time of year, it's usually spring. Uh, it's a better time for Sammy now or uh, winter. For um, winter. What do you mean? Um, is it worse or better with allergies when uh, weather is uh, warmer? Um, I think it's better I would say because during the summer I he did have the allergy but it wasn't so bad okay so let's go so yeah and hopefully it will be better but then um, the ticks you know there are a lot of ticks yeah. all like throughout all years starting I think February March until mm -hmm. October November it's full of ticks so I'm not looking forward to that yeah, that's why winter is better. <laughs> yeah, winter, they're not. They, it's every season there's something, you know? Yes, it's always something. We must, we must take care of them all the time. Yeah, come here. He, he heard a dog, so he woke up. Oh, who is here? Hello, Sammy. Look, ah. this is his face of, oh, I heard a dog. Something import, important must be going on. Pink Pals. Uh, I don't think there are many Westers who have pink pups. Like oh, same. yeah, he has these Dalmatian paws, I call them. Oh. <laughs> Very no. cute. Like he, he needs to go somewhere. Wait, let me show you. <laughs> there he is. Sammy, you are a little puppy. So now, look, if you can see, his paws are, are pink. They are normal. Okay. They're not red. Uh -huh. But when they get red, then I know that he has an allergy. Okay, okay. 
He needs to go. It's more than enough, as Sammy said. <laughs> yeah, he, his, his nap is over. Um, oh, no, she's licking you. Kiss you. Yeah, he does it always. Elton is asking if Sammy gets better after bathing with the shampoo. Um, shampoo. So if he's already having a period of bad allergies, then you don't notice it right away after a bath. But if you if I give him baths constantly every week, then everything is okay. Like now, every week so, for a vest. Oh, yeah, and the vet said that I can even uh, do two times a week if I feel the need to. Poor baby. Yeah, but uh, thankfully, no. Once a week is enough for him. Yeah, it's uh, it it's. It takes a lot of time to dry, you know, and he doesn't like it. And he stays there, but his face is like what I'm doing for you. All the things I do for you. <laughs> yes, I know. <laughs> yeah. They are not very happy to bath. No. How, how often do you bath, uh, bath the girls? Uh, I um, usually my groomer on the bath is my girls. I, I usually don't do that. So it's okay. about once uh, in a month and a half. Sorry. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> That's the dream. <laughs> yeah. That's what I used to do before. Uh, it was the same. I went every one month and a half, and that's when he took his bath. And Elton is also asking if you shampoo only the pow, only the pow. Uh, when I when I give him the bath, or just every day. Uh, uh, you probably you give him a bath whole body once a week. Yeah, yeah. I I shampoo everything when okay. I when I do the bath everything like from head to toes, his and face, you, his and, and every day I I don't use shampoo when I wash his paws. I just uh, put them in water and take the dirt off, and that's it. Okay. Yeah. I, I used to before, but now I don't know why I don't do it anymore. Just because it's sometimes it's three walks a day. So, yeah, it's fine. <laughs> okay, it's a lot of bathroom for Sammy. Yeah. Yeah, he's, I'm telling you, before he used to cry. But now he's like, you know, he's just staying there. It's and I need to, I need, it's the, this is a trick. Um, you need to take uh, to to know what time to bathe him. Like if you bathe him when he's really active, like uh, in the afternoon, it's bad. He doesn't stay in one place. He keeps going like this. And it's... but but if I choose a time like now, when he's sleepy and he's not in the mood, then he'll stay there and see there. It's a good advice. <laughs> yeah, I learned it the hard way. Wait until your dog starts to nap and get him. To the bathroom <laughs> yeah sometimes okay. when I, I hold his head and I shampoo his face and he's like oh, he's sleeping almost I have to film this once you know yeah the bath it's very it good be funny. very good yeah <laughs> <laughs> yeah you're lucky that your girls don't have any allergies um I don't like uh, to be very loud about this because when you say loud <laughs> situation, yeah, <laughs> so yeah, uh, better be silent about this. Uh, Lily is very young still, so but yeah, I'm but probably. hopefully, like there are a lot of wasties with no allergies, so mm. yeah. <laughs> anything can change, of course. So yeah. it's good to have a lot. Uh, more information about all this, what what it can be. Yeah, that's true. Where's Dina? Is she there in the back? Yeah. Oh, okay. I just see something a little bit in the corner. No, that, that's Dina. <laughs> okay. She's more independent, right? Uh, very, very. She's very wasty. I love her. <laughs> Okay, so uh, no more questions, and I think we can say goodbye to everyone here. Yeah?
It was very okay. nice. It was great talking to you. We should do this again. Okay, no problem. <laughs> <laughs> okay. When you go out, uh, you can show me you, uh, your surroundings. I know Portugal yeah. is beautiful. But it's really know. beautiful. Yeah, we have a forest in the back. Okay. And oh, it's amazing. Uh, one day when it's sunny, I'll take you for a walk there. Yeah, let's go for a picnic. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Okay, great. Well, thank okay. you very much for your time. Thank you for inviting me. Okay. You're welcome. Okay. Kisses bye -bye. to the girls. Bye. Bye bye.